What's going on guys, Time here, and today I'll show you guys how to fix the color balance using Final Cut Pro X, or you can also call it fixing the white balance, and if you want to try it, you can also download this particular video from the link in the description below for free. So let's get started. Once you have downloaded the file, import the file, and put it on your timeline, the first thing that you'll see is that the white balance for this video is pretty off. You can see that it's pretty yellowish, which is not that good. So first of all, go to this website, which the link will be in the description below. And then what you have to do is click on this link right here and it will start to download the plugin. It is completely free. Once you have installed the plugin, just select the clip and click the effect panel and go to the search bar and search for RT color balance. Now just select the effect and drag and drop it to the clip. Now you can close the effect panel and open up the adjustment panel. And as you can see right here, the RT color balance is activated. Now what you have to do is crop the video by clicking on this button, select crop. And now what you'll crop is only the white part in the frame. So I'll just pick that part right there. Try to make the crop as small as possible so that you will only get the white color that you want. Once you have done that, just click done. And now you're ready to fix the color balance. Just click command 7 to open up the video scope. Now click on the settings button which is on the top right and change it to waveform and RGB parade. Once you have done that, you'll see three lines which represent red, green, and blue. So now we'll be working with the highlights for the video. Click on the arrow, and then what we have to do is adjust the red, green, and blue so that it will match each other. Keep it around 100 if you can. So I just push the blue up a little and make it around 100. And as you can see, the white color seems a little bit more white now, but I think it's still a little bit yellowish. So to see the whole picture, what we have to do is go to the crop here and then hit reset with this arrow. And as you can see, it looks pretty good, but it's still a little bit yellowish. So I'll just adjust the blue. So just increase it a little bit until it looks right. Once you're satisfied, just hit Command 7 to close the video scope. And as you can see right here, it looks much better. And to see the after and before, you can click this blue box and you can see the after and the before and it looks much better. From now, you can make some minor tweaks to make it look as good as possible. So that's pretty much how you fix the color balance using Final Cut Pro X. As you can see, this is much better than the default color correction in the program. I would like to thank RippleTraining.com for making this awesome plugin. And I would also like to thank the Redhead Nerds YouTube channel. He's the one that made this tip. So that's pretty much it guys. If you like this video, please feel free to share it. Like it if you like it. Comment down below if you have any question. And please subscribe for more reviews.